Stewart is live in North Birmingham with more on that. Kevin? Uh, Brenda, train tracks like these can be found throughout much of North Birmingham. In fact, right now the city has two cameras located at two different railroad crossings, most of, all of them here in the Collegeville vicinity. A lot of people don't know about that, and the city plans on expanding this program. Today, we took an inside look at the current system. Hey, Rescue 13 the service we made the call this time. <laughs> At North Birmingham's Fire Station 13, you're always on the lookout before you head out the door. Train tracks surround this area, forcing fire and rescue crews to call dispatch for backup routes should a train block their path. Has anybody got the railroad route? It's crucial when seconds count. Five years ago, two people died in Collegeville. A train blocked the fire crew. A year later, the state agreed to use federal grant money for five cameras at railroad crossings. So far, only two cameras are strategically placed in Collegeville to warn dispatchers what's on the tracks. Because we knew that the federal funding and the, the, the amount of time it takes to get these programs into effect was going to be lengthy, uh, we knew we had a, a significant problem in the Collegeville area, and we went ahead and advanced with the city doing the uh, work through our traffic engineering department here. Emergency crews say it's not a cure-all because the trains can't be stopped, but it's a huge help. Then we can call for a station uh, outside of that area as the second or third response in to start that way. Now the city is going ahead with plans to add six more cameras for a total of eight. It has a general idea where it will start. Uh, the exact locations have not been finalized. We would anticipate they would more likely be in the woodlawn and West End areas. We're told these cameras cost between three and five thousand dollars. Not all the money for the expansion is in place, but the hope is to have the new railroad cams in place within two years.